Hey everybody! Omega Golden plays Civilization VI. Rise and Fall continues with our Chandra Gupta of India playthrough here. We're in a dark age. We're currently at peace with uh, Rome, but at war with America. What we're looking to do, though, is go to war with Rome again. And the reasoning there is that I'm a madman. No, the reasoning there is that we can use our uh, War of Territorial Expansion. Or oh, we should be able to, right? Don't you get that at military tradition? Do we not have that with him? And we're gonna make a peace with America right now. What, what are you willing to give me? Give me some peace. How about this? There we go. Let's get peace with you for now. We beat up your military and stuff like that, but we're gonna go after... Maybe, I... It doesn't say... We have to wait seven turns anyway, but... It's not in here as something we have available to us. A war of retribution. I've never declared a war of retribution. We'd have to denounce him at some point here, which I'm fine with that. Maybe we should just denounce him now and be like, hey, forget you. This doesn't... Does this cancel our deals with him? We were only getting a couple gold per turn anyway, right? Um, does it tell us in this screen? No. I think as far as gold goes, we're getting... Five per turn from him. Okay, so... I want to denounce him and see... I don't denounce people very often, so this is... Let's see, did it kill our gold per turn from him? Well, we may have to end here. I think it doesn't, but I'm not positive. I know it breaks like, I think it breaks like open borders and stuff like that if you denounce somebody. But. I don't go denouncing people very often is the gist of what I'm getting at over here. Right, what's your, uh, what's your sitch over here? Yep. You don't have a whole lot of production available to you, my dudes. That much is obvious. We are, by the grace of God, Hello, Victoria, Victoria, Queen of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Ireland. How you doing, girl? And soon, dare I say, the Empire. What can Chandra Gupta do for you? You we find this agreeable? That's good. Let me send you a delegation. How about that? Maybe you'll find that agreeable. A strong economy begins with a strong... Oh, we can't take any of these things because we do not have a government yet. Was there anything else we probably wanted to change to, though? We may not need... This right now. We probably want maneuvers since we're about to start making our big boys. Yeah, let's do that. We're about to start making big boys. And by big boys, I mean frishes. No. You'll get that if you if you lived in the uh, the Midwest, maybe. Maybe you'd get that. Frishes Big Boy is a restaurant, by the way. That's what I'm going for. By big boy, I mean Varu. Varu are our actual big boys that we're talking about right now. So reference you didn't understand. Thank you, Omega Alden. Keep up the good work, sir. <laughs> no, some of you may have got it. I don't know. You might you might have been to a, a big boy of the Frisch's variety at some point in your life. You may travel. You may be from, like, Ohio or something like that where I think they exist. Well, I know they exist in Ohio. <laughs> they might exist elsewhere. I don't know. I do not know. I'm not learned. 
in the ways of the Frisch's big boy. Uh, no, if you don't know what Frisch's big boy is, you should go online and look up Frisch's big boy because it has the best like mascot thing ever. It's like this giant creepy looking uh, boy, like young man. And he's in like, I think he's in like suspenders and like red and white. And he's just like, they have those like out in front of the restaurant. They're gigantic. My troops are merely passing by. I'm not going to make any such promise to you, buddy. So we can't do a war of territorial expansion. Why is that? I feel like we should be able to. Uh, I guess, hold on, Chandragupta. Can declare a war of territorial expansion after gaining the military training civic. Isn't that what I got? Military training, yeah. Oh! No, I don't have that yet. Why did I think I, oh, I have military tradition. Guys, your boy's an idiot. There we go, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's all good. We figured it out. We pieced it together. We can use the old noodle. So we're not going to have that bonus against them, but we are going to be making some Varu here. Or purchasing some Varu, maybe. How much do they cost? 480 gold. Uh, you know what we should do? Buy a little monument action. Get through our policies a little faster here. You should get a monument over here, buddy. Let's go ahead and chop this. We're not waiting for... Magnus to be in every city right now. That might be a mistake. But at the same time, I'm trying to get stuff done, you know. You've only got so many turns in the game. Magnus takes a while to get settled. What's our loyalty look like, by the way? Because it should be pretty low over here. It's low. But we're working with it. You know what we need before currency? Get get your minds right. We need bronze working, dude. We need bronze working. Right, let's get you over here so you can chop this once bronze working is researched. This is how we're going to do it. This is how we do it. Alright, let's have some uh, some friendly relations with our neighbor. No, we don't. We don't like you, America. You declared war on us. Can we declare a war of territorial expansion against you? No. I'm an idiot. I already know why I cannot do that. Your boy is spazzing out. He's losing it. It's okay, though. He's, he's regaining his composure. But he is talking about himself in, like, the third person here, which, uh... That can't bode well. Alright, let's get that monument action. Let's get... Did we lose a traitor? Who killed our traitor? Was it during the war with America? Probably. That seems highly likely. So I really didn't need to uh, denounce him, but we can do a war of ret retribution soon. He doesn't... He stopped building walls. He was building walls earlier. You saw it. At least I saw it. Maybe you noticed. I definitely noticed. I probably could have put these guys on alert, but we'll probably go to war with them next turn. Now that we are able to go back to war. No, we're not. Oh, they have to break a promise for that. I thought retribution... That's not my kind of retribution, anyway. Sometimes you just get retribution when you want retribution. That's, you don't need a reason. 
Our retribution is that you're too, you're too close, man. Can we here? Let's swap positions so that you can get up close. We are going to need. I don't know what we're gonna need over here. We got a lot of guys. We're gonna have to swarm this city. And he's gonna have his little legion guys or whatever. They're gonna be rough. McGruff, Chicago, Illinois. Take a bite out of crime. All right, Rome. We're going back in. We're back in it. I'm getting you a formal war because that's the best we can do right now. Okay, so how do we want to accomplish this over here? I think you're going to get beat up, probably. Well, let's move you guys around, because this is a weird situation to be in here. Next turn we can chop, buddy. Not this turn, but next turn. Don't worry about it right now. Oh, we need... Oh, a turtle! I love turtles. I like turtles. Says the little kid in black face paint. You guys remember. It happened. So a Plains Hill right here. I guess we'll chop this next. Ouch. What are you making here? You're I'm making also the Oracle. interested in creating a lasting... Oh, we've got bronze working. So were you attacked by just this guy? Let's go ahead and do this. Oh, you were attacked by Rome. Hopefully you don't get killed now, buddy. We'll see what happens. Do not harm me. I am a... Archer for the Indian... People, I do not deserve to be treated this poorly. All right, uh, dude, we need Varu over here. I mean, the good news is they're coming, but uh, the bad news is not yet. Let's get irrigation to try to finally get some of these bonuses going. Chop this, please. We've got a battering ram. Oh, the pain. I don't think you're safe here, buddy. Just a gut reaction. Really? This is no longer being occupied, which is nice. All right, buddy, what do you need? Can you get get a trader? Cause you you need production. I don't know. You got some problems here, buddy. We've got issues, and we've got issues here with a very jammed up little corridor here. You fire. You can fire at this guy, so let's take him out. Let's try to take him down. Nice. Okay, you can get battle fry. Let's hit the city. I need to move these people in. The city's cra cramped, and I don't really want to go through Rome right now. Or maybe I do. Maybe I actually do. Thousands have lived with. Thousands have lived without water. None, or love, none without water. 
What if they lived oh, purely on... On love and water was not part of the equation, what would you say then, buddy? Wouldn't that be crazy? I mean, it'd be a little, a little crazy. You'd have to rethink your whole statement there. Oh, it's lost it again. Please accept my warmest thanks for your kind endeavors on the continent we share. That's what I'm here for, Victoria. That's what your boy Chandra Gupta is all about. And losing archers, apparently. He's also about that. Okay, let's go ahead and move you, even though that's dangerous. Let's move you. Let's fire upon this bad boy. You get in here and heal up. We're about to get that there Temple of Artemis. You tread on dangerous waters. In you just were talking about how great I was. What changed? Politics is the art. Oh God, give me the uh, give me this oligarchy. here do we want isolationism we don't have any trade rats going right now so i think the answer is no there let's get strat strategos strat strategos strategery let's get that going so this has been a pretty i would say this is the most successful war we've ever had not true. Oh, I should have uh, used your promotion. Now you're probably toast. Right, let's grab mysticism for the free envoy. Let's build some walls over here. What's your fat? Your fastest route is over here. Okay, so send him through. Send them on through. Heal this bad boy up. Our cities are now way stronger because of the creation of Avario, which is nice. You guys survived. When I saw the house of Artemis that mounted to the clouds, the those of other marvels lost their brilliancy. And I said, lo, apart from Olympus, the sun never looked on aught so grand. Antipater of Sidon. I like to say nice I practice militant. I don't like to say I practice militant mysticism for some reason. I should say it more often though. All right, we're going for it. We want to get our military tradition here. Hello, Iron. Hi, Omega. Good to see you today. Let's try to secure this city. We are about to get a beat down from their units over here. This is a, some might say an idiotic fight. Others may be a little nicer to me about it. But we have made our uh, Granada, Grenada, what's going on? How you doing? You're my buddy now. Please. Oh, maybe I should have just attacked the city there. I thought that I could kill that archer though. We'll send him packing. Let's move you over here so that you're less likely to get killed. Right, buddy. Roll on through.
Don't reinvent the wheel. Can we take this with a couple shots here? Looks like we can. We don't even need a couple shots, maybe. Well, let, let's knock it down to zero and then send him in here. And we'll keep the city. Rebellion in four turns. Magnus, buddy. Actually, no, we got a new, we got a new friend. Let's get... Let's get Long up here. She's gonna help a little. Not a whole lot, though. Let's get our step well to get our bonus. Is this a good spot for it? It might be okay. We can put a couple farms here, but that's all the bonus we'd get from it. Oh, we can also build the... This thing. There's an achievement based around this thing? It's with a certain wonder. If you can build these things next to a certain wonder... I think it's the military policy card wonder i forget what that one's called but if you can do that you can get some stuff going on there i don't know plus two culture on tiles is nice but i think we want to well we want to get this for the plus four era score and then we want to get this cotton next All right, let's actually get currency. All right, you heal up over here. What are they gonna do? They beat up my, my archer buddy. All right, we can move you here. So that we can successfully move you back. Let's start attacking the archers because they're the the major threat here. So what's your actual five turns only? You're about to grow and help us with a little bit of loyalty pressure. You're about to grow as well. So maybe it's not terrible. If we move you here, you don't get to move again. You don't get your, you you use your action to do such a thing. So we're gonna put you back here. Get you not killed. We could make peace with them for now. Giving us time to get our war of territorial expansion going. Let's do that. Because that'll take us a little bit to get set up. So rebellion in eight turns because we gained a little bit of population around here. So this gives us a little time to recover over here. You can go get your luxuries. We'll be able to take this city back no problem. We're gonna wait. We're gonna get that War of Territorial Expansion. We're gonna take Rome on. We got a couple Varu. We finally got our Pantheon. What do we want with the Pantheon? We have a whole lot of floodplains. Does that bonus still exist? Lady of the Reeds and Mar Marshes. So, a whole bunch of floodplains over here. I think it also applies to marshes. What else? What other options do we have here? So, that one is potentially a decent amount of production. 
we could get oral tradition, which would get us some uh, some culture. Plantations would get us some culture. Let's go oral tradition here. And now let's get our... Oh, should we build the pyramids? I think we probably should try to get the pyramids. I like having the pyramids for the bonus worker charges. It's a pretty nice pickup. Alright, so the Bari were coming out to help us. Look at our plantation. We have a little time at peace here. If we can take Rome, I feel like our loyalty stuff is not as bad. Rome is causing us some loyalty pressure. I don't know how long this era is going to last. How long does it say? 20 to 40 turns still? Come on now. Come on now, we can do better than that. I feel like we can do better than that. We could do that in 10 turns. So we're gonna wait till we can declare our War of Territory of Expansion. We'll get our bonuses. We should be able to knock Rome out of the park. Just a gut feeling there. Let's get Mohanjo. Get a little bit of the old plus two culture bonus going on. Always a fan favorite, that one. Oh, yeah. Oh, it feels good to have elephants on the front line. It feels mighty good. Dude. Money. My friend, why would you say it such a thing to me? You, happiness. you should be on my side, buddy. Cheering me on. You're in my corner. Or you should be, but uh, apparently not. Alright, we probably should go to also get machinery to back up our... Our Varu here. With crossbows. We lost most of our archers, but we still got two around. Right, let's get a worker over here, builder. I want to chop some of this. I want to build a campus somewhere around here. Rebellion in two turns. How dare you. So if we surround the city once, uh, you know, once it's going to flip, we should just be able to smack it around pretty easily, I think. I don't think they kick you out of the territory anymore when it goes to free cities. I think they changed that in the last patch. If bread is the first, so we should be able to stop it. We sh and we should also look at getting. Here, let's slow this thing down. Let's give ourselves this limit. Uh, limit and I. <laughs> limit and I. I don't actually know how to say that, as you can plainly see. I don't need to spell it out for you. That's a word I'm not familiar with. Alright, buddies. We will just take this back. With our elephant anger. You can't get out of here. Alright, well that's unfortunate. We have to move you so that you can get out of here so that we can actually attack the city again. But we can just take the city back. Or not. Close enough. Whatever. Elephants. Putting in good work. I'm not scared of expansion. Stop saying such slanderous filth. I'm gonna declare war on you. You should know this. It's not exactly a secret. 
They're like stomping the unit there. I'll move you guys back up here. Send in our governor. Alright, we're gonna hold this one better this time. It's gonna last longer. We're gonna have military training. We're gonna be able to declare our war. Do you need to have denounced them for that? I don't know. We'll figure it out. I hope you don't have to. But if you do, we'll, we'll come to terms with that. Let's get our commercial hub going here. And you need fix your monument. You guys just chill here for now. You're all good. You are all good, my dudes. All right, let's get a trade route going to. Let's go to Charleston here. Do the Charleston. All right, let's move. Let's put the warriors. I want, I want our Varu. Put our Varu on the front line there. We will go, we will declare war, we will crush Rome. Everything will be amazing. We we'll give our big boys some barding. All right, we're getting the pyramids. We need the Varu. Granada, why aren't you our friend anymore? We need, we need more points here. All right, we're about to get military training, which will give us a point, which makes them our friend again. We must have suzerain status with as many friends as possible. Normal people we must restore that... any city-states we come in contact with back to righteous independence, hopefully following us, because we love them. Alright, we wanted you to... We were going to go chop this, probably. Because we wanted to put a campus out there. Build another Varu. They're mean boys. Those who inquire. Oh, there it is. There it is, my dudes. Can we? Oh, you've already you built a. An encampment, you monster. You realize, though, that we have a battering ram right next to you, so, uh... Just enjoy that one. Used to declare war on a power that borders your empire. Must have two of your cities within ten tiles of two opponent cities. Warmonger, blah, blah, blah. Good <laughs> hello, Please. war. You are my friend. You are my only friend, war. We will knock these walls out. Knock them out the box, Luke. Knock them out. Knock them out the box, Luke. Knock them out. Now you two switch spots so that you can fire upon this. Alright, we got rid of the encampment and an archer. Drama and poetry. Granada. You are my friend. You have always been my friend. Buy this tile. For this is where we are going to build our next campus. 
Nice job, warrior friend. Let the Varu handle it from now on? From the height of these pyramids, 40 centuries look down on us. Yeah, pyramids. So we got territorial expansion now. We're in business. We've got Varu. We're looking for a golden age after this. Clarification. Heroic age. We're looking for a delicious, delicious holy age after this. Oh, Magnus, dude. Can we go ahead and move you to our capital here? We've got all sorts of stuff ready in the capital here. Capital? Maybe you should go ahead and get a... Hmm. Probably want to drop the... the... I would imagine that if we put a governor's district like right here or right here, it'd be pretty good. Because then we could put commercial over here. Um, I don't know. In one of those locations, it'd probably be fine. Let's get a library going. I guess we'll go ahead and improve this. Bananas. All right, buddy, you've done it. Get you out of here. Let's return you to safety. Let's send our Varu boys in there. They're Varu boys and they love making elephant noises. Oh, get absolutely decimated. You know we're coming for you. You have a bonus, but... Ooh, that's such a big hit right there. Dude, this territorial expansion is no joke. It is absolutely not a joke. Anybody who claims it's a joke is lying to you. It's legit. Oh my god, we're so good. The Varu will crush Rome. Did you ever think you would see Rome fall to such a... Such a thing? I didn't. Not in this day and age. I think we should... Well, we should get rid of the... Uh, see if we can get rid of the walls. Go ahead and... You already fired on the wall? Alright, we'll take the walls down. he's gonna be okay let's move you just for you know safety reasons not that I don't have faith over here we're just being cautious you know it's a dip there's a difference there cautious optimism dude our Varu is so good our good boy Varu he gets a bonus. Are you stuck in this encampment? What happened here? I'll move you here. Fire upon this boy. Trying to help my buddies over here out. Pillage for 50 gold. What is this thing? This is a Roman bath. A Roman... That's the... That's the replacement for... Um... Aqueduct, yeah. That's the word I was looking for. The thing I never build. Let's just have you fortify right now. Alright, so Rome, we need to surround Rome over here. That's 
That's our goal at the present moment. Just to surround Rome. How are you looking, buddy? We need to leave this guy in town so that you keep your... your bonus. Alright, Arvaru is in some... The poets have been... Dangerous conditions over here. We need to take him out. Before he messes with our poor Varu friends. Right, let's pillage for health. Now we do have it surrounded, so attacks, even if they hurt me, are still worthwhile. Rome. Right, we gotta you gotta stay here my friend it's unfortunate but it is the truth that's all there is to it dude so strong the Lord made is all out of art so attack that finish it off with the archer Kill him. Heal yourself, buddy. And let's heal you up as well. And then attack. Yeah, yeah. All right, we're doing we're doing things over here. Good things. Oh, full loyalty. We're gaining loyalty. We are actually gaining some loyalty over here. And that's in a dark... We're in a dark age right now. Just remember that, so... We have overcome the darkness. We see only light. So that's gonna be our campus. You know what? I'm gonna put an Alcazar here, because... Getting that extra culture is a decent thing. Oh, we brought a horseman out here. Why would he do such a thing when he knows I will destroy him? We still have our bonus, right? We can still move real far? Yeah, yeah. Let's move you in. We attack. Uh, we need to move you back to keep this thing surrounded. I want that horseman defeated is the thing. I don't think that's a a major ask or anything. Alright, let's get another builder going over here. Let's chop this down. I just want to make some choppage over here. Just a little choppage action. And should we harvest this or upgrade it? Let's upgrade. I think you're safest there at the present moment. Maybe not though. Archers, take this thing down. It's so dangerous over here. I believe. I believe in our abilities. So we want to chop this. And now, here, let's get a water mill. Up. So I think I wanted to place I think right here would be a decent spot for the government plaza. 
So I'll probably chop that and then place it there. Is he not like that I was destroying all the jungles? I've lived through some Is his policy an anti-destruction of jungle policy? Well, let's get natural philosophy in here. And let's get Praetorium in here to try to help out our loyalty issues some more. We probably could have switched Praetorium for getting a military card back. But this is fine. Alright, what are you doing over here? Let's heal you up. Beat this city down. I want to take Rome for hours. Rome needs to be ours. Okay, get your granary on. Go ahead and chop this. And, alright, let's get... Let's upgrade Magnus so we can potentially build some more settlers. I think there's still going to be... I mean, there's still some room in locations to settle. We need amenities. I'm going to build a mine up here. Dude, we're taking Rome, though. And then we're going Heroic Age. Alright, let's get, can we get rid of you. For the good of our people. Alright. You are deceased. You are no more. Rome, I need you to just go ahead and fall. If you would just fall, please, that would be lovely. What are you going to get up here? Our campus? Our plus three campus right up there? We'll probably decimate all that stuff at some point, but for now it's a decent adjacency bonus and, you know, we can roll with that. So this is probably going to be where we build our commercial hub over here. Although we could drop it right here and then get a decent bonus for all of these boys. Probably. Oh, we need you to be our actual friend. Continue to be our friend, buddy. Remember that we are always the best of buds. Wait, what, what happened? Who died? Our archer was destroyed. Oh. Yes! Oh, and... Yeah, they didn't make it. This is what we're talking about here. Monumentality is amazing if you can deal with it, but we don't have a lot of faith generations, so I don't know... I don't think it's a worthwhile endeavor for us. But really, there's not a whole lot better. These give you a little more boost. Let's just do... Uh... Actually, let's do this one. Wait, commercial hub and harbors provide science as well. We do need to get commercial hubs going. Let's do this. And this, and this. <laughs> I forgot that we're in a heroic age, so we... Yes! Heroic age. That's what I'm talking about right there. Alright, the Varu. So we lost. That sucks. We're so close to having 
having machinery. This is a... We might be able to take it this turn and then, but we're gonna lose some, we're gonna lose some boys if we do this. Yeah, let's do this. I want the city that bad. Keep the city, yes. All right, we got Rome on our side. But now, yeah, we're gonna lose We're probably going to lose somebody over here. Or maybe not. We might lose this. This warrior might get killed. But we got rid of the horseman that was terrorizing our back lines there. Dude. We did it. Let's get him some ancient walls right away. Let's see where everybody is here. Science. Gilgamesh. Oh my god, Gilgamesh. Yeah, that's a problem. He is my buddy, but it is a problem that he's my buddy. Because he is just crushing it scientifically. We are going to have to deal with that. So, uh, culturally, we're similar to everybody out here. Score-wise, Gilgamesh is... You know, 120 points ahead of us. But we did take Rome, so we took Rome. If we can take some of this territory around us, we can potentially... I don't think going after Gilgamesh right now is the is the play. I think he's probably real strong. I think we want to try to roll and maybe conquer America. Finish taking some of Rome. You know, roll with what our strengths are. And our strengths are currently that we have the Varu and the territorial expansion thing. We don't necessarily want to go after our buddy, our declared friend until you know until the time to strike we got to be sure that it's time to strike we can't just go in willy-nilly here but that's going to be it for this episode guys um let me know what you think like the video if you're enjoying it subscribe if you'd like to see more and i'll catch you guys next time later everybody